like and subscribe. That's right, this is a special Leonardo toy watch. Push his head down, we squeeze, and whoa, here it comes. Let's open up this Leonardo and see all the cool things he can do. So here he comes, head dropping Leonardo out of the sewers and ready to find Shredder. And look, if Shredder comes, Leonardo can put his head in the shell, right? And then you squeeze his leg and it pops right back out. So you just gotta squeeze his legs and it pops. So watch. Whew. Hey, we need to see that in slow motion, I think. Don't you? Whoa! That was really cool. But you know what? His head going up and down is just part of the fun for this Leonardo. There's other things we can do, too. Let's show how his swords work and how he can even put them and hold them here on his back of his turtle shell. So let's see all these cool things. Now the shredder's on. Look at this. You can Leonardo can use his swords to defend himself and try to keep Shredder from doing anything bad. So he has a full range of motion. You can turn his hands so he can go hi -ya! like that. Now his legs turn, and of course, when you squeeze them, his head pops out. So lots of cool range of motions that you can do with Leonardo. Now, I really like Leonardo, and I like his katana swords. Now, they're not real sharp, so they're not going to cut you, but you can pretend that they are. And then when he's all done, you know what Leonardo's going to do? Like a good ninja, he's going to put his swords away. Just like that. Right? Because we don't want them to accidentally cut somebody. That wouldn't be any good, would it? So he can put his swords away, and he can go about his business, maybe looking for pizza and other cool things like that. Of course, it fits right here on his back. Pretty neat stuff, I think. Now I know what you're going to say. Is this the only head dropping Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle we have? Nope, we also have Raphael, but we're going to show him in a different video. So you're going to want to make sure to stay tuned for that one, aren't you? But this one is on Leonardo. Hey, now what are some of the cool things we can do with stories with Leonardo? Hmm, let's see if I can come up with one. So Leonardo's just walking around, and guess what happens? He gets slime on his head. Oh no! What's he going to do? It's not just any slime, it's keeping his head pushed into his turtle shell. Oh, Leonardo, how is he going to be able to see if the slime keeps his head pushed down so he can't walk around and see where he's going? I think he's got an idea. Leonardo's reaching back for one of his swords. He has one of his swords, but he's got to be careful not to cut himself. Oh, he's got a hook on the slime. Boy, Shredder really thought this one through, trying to keep Leonardo's head stuck in his shell. I think it's starting to work. Let's see if he can pop his head up now. Oh, he's getting there. Not quite, though. A little bit more. Come on, Leonardo, you can do it. Look, he grabs his other sword, too. Hmm, I think he's got a plan. Finally, he got his head out of his shell, but he's still got slime all over him. I think he's going to be able to cut through it, though. Look, he's able to get it off. All right, good job, Leonardo. Whew, I thought Shredder was going to get you trapped inside that slime. But he was no match for you, was he? <laughs> Leonardo's going to take and play a trick on Donatello or Raphael and get them all covered in slime. Hey, I think that's going to be pretty funny. What do you think? Okay, so we saw lots of fun ways that we can play with the Leonardo head popping Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. So again, push his head down, it pops right back up. You can remove his swords whenever you want to, and when he has them in, he can do lots of cool things and motions and fight like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Uh-oh. Leonardo, you need to hold on to your sword a little bit better than that, buddy. Let's put that back in there. So there he goes, ready for battle. Now, hey, what is your favorite Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle? Do you like Leonardo, Raphael, Donatello? Which one is your favorite? I've always kind of liked Donatello and Leonardo as my favorites. But you know what? Leave me a message and let me know which one's your favorite. And also, another thing I want you to do up here, it says subscribe here. Now, the engineering family has a few other ideas for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles videos, and we really want to see you had to see them. So that if you like it, make sure you push subscribe here so that you can watch all of our videos. And also, make sure that you type in the comments that you subscribe. That way we can say thank you. Also, give us a like. Now, we've not done a lot of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle videos yet, but if you've put a lot of likes, 
we're definitely going to do more because that means that we know that you like them and we like making videos that you like. And finally, we've got a secret password and it's just TMNT. That stands for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles because right? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is pretty hard to write. It's a lot of words. So we're just going to type in TMNT, the first letter for each word. Okay, everyone, I really hope that you've liked this head popping Leonardo video. So remember to subscribe, thumbs up, TMNT. Bye! So long. I'm like Leonardo. I think I want some pizza. Bye! Now take a look at one of these cool videos that feature surprise eggs, Scooby-Doo, Paw Patrol, and even J.